Computer networks use protocols. Protocols are the rules that govern communications. Very similar to the protocols used in human communications. In human communications, we have protocols like language. If I'm speaking to somebody, we want to use a common language so we can understand each other. We may have other types of protocols that we use. Do we talk formally or informally? How we greet each other. There's a protocol for that. Even how we dress or conduct ourselves. All of this is our protocols that help govern human communications. In computer networks, we use protocols also to help govern communications between two devices. For example, here are some common protocols. A computer message is actually made up of several protocols. In this message here, we have the Ethernet protocol. The Ethernet protocol governs network interface card to network interface card in the same network. We have Internet protocol. Internet protocol governs communication from the original source all the way to the final destination. Make sure the message gets there and gets there all along the way. These devices called routers know where the packet is going. IP is for that. There's TCP, Transmission Control Protocol. This protocol makes sure that the information gets there reliably. And if it arrives out of order, if there's a sequence of packets all associated with the same message, it makes sure that they get reordered properly. And then there's HTTP, Hypertext Transfer Protocol. This protocol governs the exchange or transfer of HTML hypertext markup language. So when we are requesting a web page or downloading a web page, the, the message can contain all of these protocols. So in computer networks, we use many different protocols. Learning about network protocols will give us a better understanding of how networks operate, how to implement and configure networks, and also how to troubleshoot networks.